All right, I finished Laser Defender. I was kind of screwing around in there and I um, figured out how to change my icons. So there's the icon I picked based on the uh, sprite pack that we were using in the game. So I can double click here. I also figured out how to fill this out instead of having it um, look funky. Um, they did say this is going to be deprecated in a future version. So um, you'll see here things are a little funky because this game happens to be extremely tall. And um, they didn't go over in the uh, class what to do about that um, when you've got a wide window here. If I just do it as full screen, uh, it looks messed up. So I found a resolution that works, 720 by 576, having it be windowed and in the options making it so that I can resize the window. So when I hit play, oh, I figured out how to add that too. That's pretty cool. So you see it looks like this. That's no good. See, and if you maximize it, that's what it looks like. So that's no good either. So what you got to do is kind of bring it towards there. There we go. That's what the game should look like. the volume for a second um, so I did get the um, control working the Xbox one controller which is pretty cool so I'm gonna play with the Xbox one controller and um, you'll see um, you'll hear the music we added you'll see the enemies all the special effects all the stuff it's pretty neat all right let me turn the volume back up Of it, it will be easy to stay on top of it. You let them hang up things that you have. So, playtesting should probably make it those pink guys move a little bit faster just to up the challenge. But the option is there. Yep, and so, uh, improvements. I'd like to do um, next time include um, uh, adding a high score that you can play against and also having like a high score table that'll show. Um, everyone else has scored. They can put their initials just like the old arcade games. Um, so there you go. That's the game I created. Pretty pretty happy with it. You know, I need to fix the back guys a little bit just to make it a little bit harder. Um, although it's not that I can't lose. And um, yeah, the next game is going to be a Plants vs. Zombie clone. And I'm really excited to get into that. But I've got a couple other little projects I got to work on for a little bit before I get back to that. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye.